Alright, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Machia Villain. It's... I don't even know how to describe this. I guess you're making a ha haunted house with, like, Frankensteins and brains and shit. I don't know. This will be interesting. Anyway, let's just get started and we'll see see how this how this goes. Being a minion, what a dream job. First class evil boss, a steady supply of stupid victims guaranteed. Murder and mayhem every day. What a beautiful life. Or not. I actually have to continue these. The boss was an exploitative douche and really life sucks. So one clever minion rose from their miserable minion dition and applied to the League of Machiavellian Villains. It cost them an arm and a leg. Well, somebody else's. But it was worth it because... One night, an evil owl bursts through the window bringing the most important and only letter of the minion's life. Congratulations, lowly minion. Your application to the League of Machiavellian Villains has been approved under conditions. Please bring this letter to the Department of Evil Domains to receive your plot of evil land and further instructions. Dishonestly yours, the League of Machiavellian Villains. <laughs> Murdered the owl, of course, and the owl's got tons of sixes on its chest. I like the detail in this. At last, the minion's days of servitude are over. No more unpaid overtime, no more scrubbing toilets. But before the minion departs, one last evil deed. No! And now to become the biggest, baddest, most powerful villain ever. Okay. Wait behind the line. Ticket, very long. Yeah, this is taking forever. How dare they delay my evil, evil plans? I shall make them pay. I just, I just don't want to lose my place in line. They will pay later. But then they'll pay with interest. <laughs> Next. Oh, that's me. Now my reign of evil can begin. <laughs> See, what is our villain name? Um. See, what's our villain name? We're gonna be Hugsley Fluffybutt. Dearest Hugsley Fluffybutt, in addition to your evil domain, the Machiavellian League of Villains is giving you three minions to start your domain. Don't lose them. Fair warning, the above mentioned minions are brain dead. They will not do anything unless ordered to. You will soon receive another letter with our code of dishonor, if you've managed to survive until then. Murderously yours, the Machiavellian League of Villains. Okay. So these minions want to join your team, Hugsley Fluffybutt. So we've got uh, a bunch of these guys. Fight jobs. So build floors, chop wood, dig into rock, collect resources, clean blood, repair damages, bring resources to storage, extinguish fire, refill and reload things that need need to be, make objects or furniture, write letters, print newspapers, surf the internet, needs a home office. Cook or smoke food. Research items. Heal minions. Needs a research room. Okay, we also have made of bones. Lose two with each bone, thro bone thrown during an attack. Gain one with each bone eaten. A okay, street rat and easygoing nature. Eats bones, so... Rasputin trainee. Poison resistance. Crazy poison resistance. See, this is a zombie. Late for its death. Extra life. Relaxed. We've also got different equipment, but this is the difference between 
Okay, skeletons. Oh, it's a psychopath. So skeletons are weak to f weak, but easily fixable. He uses his own bones to attack. He is resilient and can fix himself by eating the bones he takes from his victims. Psychopaths can be equipped with all kinds of weapons. Be aware that they bite, even if they say they don't. Bessie. Zombies are slow, but they don't need a lot of food. You can grow your team with this special ability, Infected Bite. So you probably want one of these guys. Maybe not this one, though. Reduced loyalty is kind of rough. And another psychopath. Fireproof, stressed nature. Very good cook. It's mildly tempting to, to go with the zombie regardless, just because of infected bite. Grab your enemy. House camouflage. Which one's infected bite? Ah, here we are. Uh, turn a victim into an inferior zombie. After one second, transform the target into a zombie with a trait. Waits for his second death. Lose 30 life points per day until dying a second time. Yeah, let's hire let's hire this guy. And then we'll probably grab the skeletons. Okay, validate selection. Okay, basic controls, click for more info. Hi. I don't know if I think we're paused. So let's go. So click the messages from the Machiavellian League of Villains to help you do your evil deeds. Messages will go to the archives, but in the lower low right corner of the screen this. Okay. So, WSJ to pan the camera, mouse wheel to zoom in and out. You can accelerate time with the speed buttons in the top right corner. Space will pause or resume your game. Cool. Assign the job Chopwood to at least one of your minions. Let's see, if I remember right, can I check based on skills? Okay, Lula. See, job, max number of jobs assigned. Let's see, assign the job Chopwood to at least one of your minions. Your minions are waiting for orders. Use the jobs menu. Jobs menu, okay. So Chopwood. So we can give them four different, um, four different jobs along the way. So we don't have anybody that's good at mining, so I guess we'll have Penny do it. And we don't have any of those. So I guess we'll set Penny Penny to those. I'm just going to kind of set whatever for now. We are going to need... Oh, he only has three jobs. Well, in that case... There we go. That'll have to do for now. So this, this looks like it's very much in the style of RimWorld or... Honestly, looking at it now, this really feels like it was inspired by uh, Oxygen Not Included. The visual style. I mean, it is very much a, a clay type of... Uh... It's very much like a, a clay style of... System. So Bessie is not doing anything. Neither of these are. So let's extract some stone. Okay, harvest resources. In order to build your mansion, Take care of your and take care of your minions. You need to harvest resources. Resources menu. Select the types of resources you want to collect. Then the jobs menu. Okay, so resources. Chop wood. Dig into rock. Collect plants. I see. It's a question. Could I potentially have some kind of? Yeah. Okay. Maybe a bit more. This this is this is absolutely ox oxygen not included. Okay. What is what is Penny queued for? Maintenance and mining. Okay. How about instead of maintenance, because we have nothing, we'll just set her to gather. That'll give me something to do at least for a little while. Huh. Okay, it's not a very big map. So we'll just kind of wait for a while. Build a room. Build the biggest evil mansion of all time. Select the build menu to build floors, walls, and doors. And remember to get your minions to build in the jobs menu. Okay, so I can make rooms. What I probably actually want to do is build it up here. Considering this game's visual perspective, we probably want to go over here.
I've also got gold. Let's just grab these for a second. Resources, chop wood. Hopefully, okay, so I've got 40 brains, uh, smoked brains, and bones. So these guys aren't going to st starve immediately. The game also has some weird audio balancing. That initial cutscene, the music was real loud, and then, now we're here, really quiet. I haven't turned it down. This is, this is default for reasons. Okay, so what do we have? Construction. Do we have ad campaign research area? Firefighting area, blood cleaning area. I was hoping we could have like a, a storage. Ah, food storage, material storage, equipment storage, gold storage. Yeah, a bunch of those later. Extra instructions. The League of Machia Villain Villains gave you basic instructions. Take a look at them by clicking on the startup guide button in the bottom right or die of excruciating pain. Okay, you know what? Let's pause for a second. I'm gonna go read that, and then we'll we'll pick this back up again. Otherwise, I'm just gonna be spending forever doing things. Okay, so there's a fail state here. The suspicion level is kind of rough to work with. Okay, higher your suspicion level, the fewer victims you can lure to your mansion. When your suspicion level is really low, more victims come to your mansion. If your suspicion level is close to the max. You may trigger the villagers' wrath. Yeah, so people will attack us. Which is kind of important. Okay, so these trees are almost done, then we'll move move up and over here. Probably. Uh, can I go into the settings and turn up the... Oh. It just defaulted to weirdly slow. Twitch settings. Interesting, this has Twitch integration. Alright, I might have to start over for the next episode or, or something. Because if this has Twitch integration, then I probably want to include that somehow. Okay, cool. Chop wood. And once these trees are done, then we'll start building around here. Let's see, I can... Okay, yeah, good. The map doesn't extend too far over here. Figure it out. Okay, uh, let's do resources, construction, room. Floors. Wooden floor... Flooring for your mansion, walking speed, plus 60%, prestige, solidity, fire resistance, light wooden flooring. The difference, I think that's just visual. Walls, doors, gotcha. Just do a basic 6x4 room. Dig into those. They're busy digging. Lula. Lulu will not build. Well, we don't need refills. So let's set her to build, even though she's not good at it. It at least gives her something to do while we're here. Yeah, so I might just get as far as I can, and then we'll figure it out. Build a writing desk and a home office. There are victims inside your mansion, so minions can kill and eat them. Build a writing desk in an empty room. In the construction menu, choose home office, and then check... That at least one minion has been given the option build. Okay. So we can do ad campaigns, but we need a writing desk. Looks like we get different types. Research. Demonic acts, preserve your food, victims and villains rules, decoration of evilness, fight and heal, skeleton turret. Huh. Crypt. Increase the level of your crypt and unlock a new type of monster you will be able to hire. Okay, so we can get zombie, zombie, mummy, skeleton, psycho, and then later it's like werewolf, Dracula, toxin master. What's the final one? Clown. Okay, well, construction, rooms, walls. How do I rotate? Construction. Rooms. Walls. Maybe I do do it like this. Yeah, okay. 
That looks that looks about right. This is going to be a very small room. I guess. Might be a bit too small. Let's speed this up a little bit. Uh, let's see, resources, not resources, construction. We do need doors. So I'll probably make this a lot bigger later on. Maybe? We'll figure it out. Hopefully resources also regrow at some point. Okay, so we have path, hidden door, pretty red door, exit door. Oh, this is my front door. Cancel construction. Okay, so we want the pretty red door. But that's a type of resource I don't have. Log of evil wood. Maybe I don't have the ability to make one of those right now. So I guess we'll just start with one of these. Rooms, I guess. We're going to need a lot more room than this. Let's see, resources, dig into rock. Let's get rid of all of this. Make some room. Let's see, and I want to make a home office. Oh, okay, so I can rotate it. I don't think it, I don't know if I want to have the home office be in the entry entryway. I don't know if it gets broken. Well, I'll do it for now. Like I said, learning. Oh, they sleep during the day, of course they do. Rules. We must kill them all. Kill them only when they're alone. Kill the virgin last. Kill them at night. Do not kill the dog ever. Build two closed rooms. Survive three days. Unlocks a slot for a new minion. And minions will want to join me. Okay. And gold coins are available. Eight days of food left. Seems reasonable. So this is this is going to take some time. I guess let's do rooms, walls. Actually, cancel these. Okay. Fun fact: you don't need to put um, you don't need to put a floor underneath the wall. I mean, I guess that was kind of obvious, but important to note nonetheless. Okay, rooms, floors, walls, doors. Oh, dark flooring. Doesn't seem like it's got any kind of difference. We also have flagstones. Yeah, I probably should have looked at some of these. We'll do wood for now. I'm just trying to get quick and dirty so I know what I'm doing, so that when I start over with Twitch integration and whatnot, this will get, uh, this will get easier. Because, yeah, we don't have any evil evil wood logs or anything of the sort around here. Ah, uh, let's see. What else do we have? Traps. Rotating wall. Rotating wall for virgin. Bankers. Pushing wall. Saw wall. Spider web wall. Victims. Bookshelf. Attracts geeks. Entertain the victim for a second. One second. Fence watchtower, watchtower lamp. Yeah, this is very clearly oxygen not included style. Basic protection against thieves. Yeah, so I'll have to look into one of these, but I don't have that immediately. Okay, so we've gotten a couple of levels here. Level of loyalty. Okay, they're they're fine for now. Okay, I've been promoted to the rank of one. Okay, built built the closed rooms, survived three days, unlocking a slot and team for a new minion. Minions want to join. Select an ad campaign. Let's pause for a second. Okay, so I can get a mummy. We'll eat meat. I don't have... I don't have any meat right now. 
or we could get another skeleton. I don't... I have some bones. Very good at moving to storage and grabbing resources. That is life. Relax nature. I mean, I could go with a... a vampire. Very good at researching items, healing minions, and so on and so forth, but we need a research room. Mummies are hard worker. They're fast and need little food. Special attack, none. Sunburns. Loses extra health of health per day when not in a closed room. Can catch fire. Okay, let's stay away from the vampire for now. The mummy might not be a bad idea, but might also get really hungry. Because uh, we don't have anything immediately. But yeah, let's just grab a mummy. Good at mining. Uh, kind of okay at research. Validate selection. Okay. So we're working on that for a little while. Let's run an ad campaign. Letters. Base loot. Possible loot. What's the difference? Well, let's go with this one. First. Select an ad campaign for today. Or do I need letters first before I can do anything? Jobs. Okay. Well, I have a home office. None of these guys are good at it. So I guess we'll set him to... Or Christina, her. We'll set her, her to it. And building, because we always need more building. What if you can set priorities? Maybe not. Christina, interact. Building would be nice, but we need we need those letters written. Interact. Okay, craft a letter. Now that you have a home office and a writing desk, you're just two steps away from sending letters to attract victims. Set the number of letters you want to write by left-clicking on the writing desk. Ah, you can select infinite. Okay. One, we want to make ten. And let's maintain a stock of ten. Make. Okay, cool. So now, we can potentially get that. Okay, rise to the top of evil villains. You can climb to the, climb up, climb, yeah, you can climb up the League of Evil Villains if you follow the objectives displayed in the rank box. Expect a reward from the League of Villains with each promotion. Okay, oh, we do have some smoked meat. Must have just come with the mummy. Okay. Well, hopefully we'll be able to get some letters here and then we can um, actually progress. We have one letter. You will make... You will write letters. It is a requirement. Otherwise, we're in trouble. We're gonna need food within a couple of days. Okay, got it. Ad campaign. So we wanna do just the basic one. Okay, how, how do we do? I'm gonna... Okay, that's a different one. Archives, send feedback. So how do we do an ad campaign? Oh, I can set the priority. Cool. I'll set that to very high. That way I can give the mummy jobs again. Okay. So how do we do... Oops. I didn't mean to send a blank email. Select an ad campaign for today. Cost five. Oh, maybe I already did it.
Because we're out of... We're out of letters. I'm not actually sure what happened there. I might have selected it. Question, do I have a job for fighting? The answer is no. Well, while we're here, construction, we want to do... We want to do a room, walls. Just super basic. I'm going to put uh, just storage stuff in this room. Eventually, I'll convert it over into something else, but I just need to be able to store my gold not in the middle of the street. Seems like a good idea. Okay, we only have a little bit of food left. So did my ad campaign just not go through? Because we made five letters. Okay. Where's the... Wh oh, Christine is just napping over here. Okay. Food is starting to spoil. Stop mining. <laughs> All right. I, I guess setting this to very high did not matter. And I don't. I really have no idea what happened in my previous ad campaign because I wrote five letters. I thought I had five just sitting sitting around. Unless it just straight up didn't work, or bugged out on me, or I pressed the wrong button. Okay, ad campaign. I've got five. So we want to do this one. Select an ad campaign for today. Did it go? Ad campaign. Select an ad campaign for today. Um, so I've already got the writing desk down. We've got a home office, factory, bedrooms, training, laboratory. I mean, these are important things, but why can't I do this? Or maybe it'll just go. Ah, victims are coming soon. Okay, victims are on their way to your mansion. Victims get frightened and run away when they see minions or any sign of minion activity, such as an unfinished room, blood on the floor. Hide your minions out of sight in a closed room or behind trees. You can also... Oh. Okay. Select all minions. Okay, that didn't work. Oh. Mailman, go to. Unfortunately, they're going to prioritize work. I kind of wish there was an attack. Victims are coming. Okay, select your minions by clicking on them. Use the attack buttons at the bottom to kill your victims. Each minion has special powers. Stop building. Seriously, stop. Where are these victims anyway? Oh, there they are. Yeah. 
Okay. Is there another one? How about the other guy? Okay. Kill them when they're alone. Alright. So we need a butcher table. We did a number of things. My suspicion has gone up. But we do have some bits. So you cut the body part. Blood. Things. Okay. Let's do construction. Room. Door. I kind of understand this better. Sort of. Okay. Jobs. Let's do store resources. Manage. And we do have laboratory. We'll have to think about kitchen. So maybe let's stop that, go kitchen. Because we're going to need... We're going to need to cut up these people. Rots in 12 hours. Okay, construction, kitchen, butcher's table. Let's see. Lula, build this first. We need that butcher's table. We also could use anything kitchen. Dining table. Any room. Chest for gold, gold storage, food storage. Two hundred wood. Okay. Well, hopefully that butcher table will get made. And then we can deal with some of the uh, wood. We probably should actually stop with some of the... Some of this. Okay. So who's the person I set for butcher? Lula. Again. Lula. Maybe it's something I have to do here. Very high. Uh, required to process dead body parts. Needs cool. Yeah, max number of jobs. Fight. Oh, skill points. Something I should look at. Summons. Summon to the office of the League of Machiavellian Villains. You killed your first victim. Your contract of evilness is ready. We just need your signature certified in human blood ink, and you'll be good to go. Contract with the League of Machiavellian Villains, LLC. This contract is a binding seal agreement. Made between the villain and the League of Machiavellian Villains, LLC. This agreement sets forth terms and conditions that must be adhered to during the course of evil villainry. The League of Machiavellian Villains hereby agrees to award Evilium to the above-mentioned villain, provided said party abides by the terms laid in Annex 666B. The victims must kill all eligible victims. Victims should be killed when they're alone. Vict okay, we know about those. By signing the contract, or by looking at it long enough, the villain agrees to the above terms. Failure to abide by these terms will result in forfeiture of evil evilium and or incur a penalty or immediate or of immediate non-life, also known as death. Signature of League of Machiavellian Villains, representative. Sign here with blood. If the fine print is read, or if it isn't, portions of the above contract may be spontaneously altered at the discretion of the League of Machiavellian Villains, LLC. These those portions will probably be the worst ones, like that bit about you dying if you don't follow the rules. Ha. Huh. What's worse than death, right? Try double death. Or being evicted from your evil mansion while getting fired by a giant death fired at by a giant death laser. Using those really jacks up our electric bills, so do us all a favor and just follow the rules, okay? Also, here's a pro tip. Treat your minions well. They may be stupid, ugly, sm smelly, slimy, and disgusting, but they're the key to maintaining high levels of evilitude. Plus, we're pretty sure they're about to start a union. Talk about being evil. And sign here. All right. So we've killed our first victims. We kind of have a vague idea of how to do this. Um, but I think I'm going to reboot with Twitch integration and whatnot. And also not as big of a, a, a building. I have ideas on how to make this work. Like, I really want a long hallway of death. That could work well. Room. Let's see. Hidden door. As resources that I do not have access to. Okay. So that's right out for now. But, you know, a big long hallway and have all these guys hide out in like a shack elsewhere or across the street. That could be cool. That would be cool. 
I don't know how to lower my suspicion level. Either way, I'm really liking this game. I want to play more. I just want to do it right the second time around. You know, have a better idea of what I'm doing. And maybe some better minions off the bat. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, but I do enjoy this, and I'm definitely going to play more. So I guess uh, if you guys like this episode in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like. Helps more than you know. And if you want to see more, uh, hit subscribe. Because like I said, I want to do, do or die. Go as far as I can uh, over the course of like a night or two. And see just how far we could get. Because this is fun. And I guess with that, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Machia Villain. And as always, thanks for watching.